hey guys this is rosa kelly welcome back to my channel so today i'm here with a new project to share with you so let's take a look So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to share with you this beautiful book using the Mistletoe and Holly collection by Blue Fern Studios. And this collection was designed by my friend Jen Bishop and it's just stunning, so, so pretty. So this collection is one of my special edition kits that I have for, that I had for December and that I am still um, catching up with. I have two, so this is the Mistletoe and Holly and and I also have the Sweet Christmas, which is also another beautiful one. Um, so I'm going to have the link to my website if you're interested on um, these special edition kits. And also I will be having a video class only coming soon as well. Uh, but everything that you see comes in your uh, special edition kits. We have the flowers. We have this beautiful netting. We have two different packs of ephemera where you um, have all these different elements that we're using throughout the book. Um, and of course the paper collection the seam binding and so this book measures 10 by 8 and it has a 2 inch spine here and then here is the back again the paper is just so so pretty it was actually really hard to choose which side of the paper to use because both sides were also really beautiful and so now let's take a look inside the book so for this book we have two sides here we have side a side b and then we also have this center kind of like a floating page there as well and so let's take a look here on this side these little bows also come with your kit and then i have some extra flowers so i just went ahead and put them I put those here and this cute little uh, guy from the ephemera I definitely wanted to use that as well and then so this page spins around and opens up like that you can of course add a picture here but once you spin this you can now unlock this page and then this can magnetize back in place and this opens up and I did use some red cardstock to complement and just finish embellishing um, some of these large pages with some of my scrap pieces and a lot of the ephemera pieces as well. And then here is this um, page here. Again, I just really love the collection. So, so pretty. This opens up like that. And then here again, another collage. And then when we open that up, again, a lot of different ephemera pieces just to complement the solid cardstock and then we have this little spinning piece here at the center and this is one of those tower um, layouts i haven't done one of these for a while and i definitely wanted to just play around with some three-dimensional pages so basically you open these up here and then you open up the second level and then these two pieces magnetize together and then we have a tower page where you can add your pictures and these will just spin around so you can look at all the different uh, sections there so i love making these pages these are just definitely so fun to play with and so now we're gonna close those here and then this is gonna close and close and then we are going to close this piece and then you will spin this you can also add pictures there but i mainly created that as a locking page and then we're gonna look at this center um, floating page here and so again the beautiful beautiful image from the collection now if you're looking into make something more on the winter side not so much christmas you can use this image and just swap it up here for the cover uh, but i just really wanted the beautiful christmas tree on the front but this one is just so so pretty as well and so this opens up here and then again the beautiful design of the page and then this opens up and we have a double um like a two level pop up here and this one is just so so fun i'm just gonna open it like 
this for you so you can see how it works and it was again super easy to make if you have never made a pop-up like this i really go in detail on explaining you how to create the mechanism for it and then here on the top this opens up and then this one opens up there as well so you can add more pictures and then of course you can add pictures over there as well and then i just use some of my ephemera to create a little collage but you can also leave this open for a picture and i'm using this for a little like tax bar with one of my scrap pieces and then this is going to close and this is going to close there on top and then here for the back i just wanted to do something very simple so the beautiful beautiful paper a little bit of the ephemera and then this one just opens up to display again the paper on this page here all i did is use all of my scrap little pieces and just kind of glue them together to make that full page and i actually like how that turned out because the paper is very uh, like it has a little collage on the pages already so it kind of looks like it's one of the design uh, pages and now on this side we have this beautiful image again another one of my favorites and i added this christmas tree here from the ephemera and the same thing here with this little collage that i created is also from the ephemera and then this opens up like this and i just created another collage up there and then here as well a lot of the uh there was a lot of ephemera so i wanted to incorporate as much as possible here and then on the section here at the center we have uh, this other opening page and we have the beautiful um, rocking chair by the uh, fireplace and then this opens to the side here again and then this whole thing slides to the side and then i just went ahead and added that um little image this is actually from the ephemera packaging but i just really love it so i went ahead and put that there and that magnetizes in place and this magnetizes here and then this opens up to the side again the beautiful uh, paper as well and then back here just a large image from the collection and you can add a few pictures here maybe smaller pictures on the side and then on this other side we have this other opening section this opens up and down and then this opens up again and then we have a platform um, page there where you can add a picture and i just wanted to display this beautiful image this is also from one of the packaging from the ephemera so as you can see i used everything and all the red areas is where like pictures will go and so yeah so i had a lot of fun creating and so i hope that you guys enjoyed the walkthrough and i hope that you like how this book turned out i think the collection is so so beautiful and i just really enjoyed playing with this so if you want to uh, join along for the class i'm gonna have my website link down below also like i said i do have some kits still available for this beautiful beautiful um, paper collection so i hope that you guys are having a beautiful day and i will see you on the next one bye-bye